June 14. The beginning of the Bougainvillea. This hibiscus, when the wind and cold, it got buds, but nothing. Geraniums are doing well. Lots and lots of new leaves, strong plants. This is that uh, small cucumber, orange. Orange tomatoes, where are they? Right there. And that's a bushy tomato plant. Lettuce and dark green onions. Begonias. Trying to figure out which ones are pendulous and which ones aren't. Another bougainvillea. This one is the soft pink purplish one there, the old kind. This is the new hosta. From, I took it from the back over there. Uh, and the little annuals. I'm not thrilled with that. I'm, I guess I'm just not a annual kind of girl. <laughs> now here we've got the large allium. Uh, still very short. Really, really short for this time of the year. Those are the dual color cannas. What is that? Oh my dear God, a flower already. They should be about four feet tall before they bloom. Don't know what in the hell's going on. Cold, nasty weather. Oh, uh, and here. This morning we started having peonies blooming. These are the dahlias I ordered, like everything else, real short, not doing much. But one thing is they're big, but just not flowering. This is uh, I don't know, my dear God, I know what the name of this. I have a whole pile over there. Anyway, forgot the name. These are guys are starting to one kind of plant, another kind of plant. And another kind of plant. They're starting. I'm building a stone wall here. This I'll get continuing today. More peonies over there. Did the baby ones? I must say that the hens and chicks are fully happy this year. Hey Shadow, a hey, pretty boy. Let's go looking around anywhere. I feed the frogs. I give them compost and dog poop attracts the flies. Uh, 
what can I say about this? Maybe one year it'll be nice. This is a dahlia. I have no idea what color it is. Lots of little blooms. That's good. These begonias got slaughtered by the wind. Even branches of the trees broken. It just horrible wind we had. So now all the begonias are planted and that's the same kind as I just showed you and it's really battered. Tuberous begonias, fibrous begonias, shape loving plants, fibrous begonias, two begonias in pots that I have no idea what color they are. I'm gonna mark this here. This is a pendulous begonia. And it's going to be peach, big peach begonia. California poppies are starting. California poppies. And here is my new flower garden. I put calla, cannas in there and they're taking their time. Like everything is almost a month back. But the clematis are super happy. Look at that. That's at least six feet tall. So is this one. Not up to the top yet, but it will get there. My fern island. There's different kinds in there. I really love them. Oh, let's go to the other island. Weed, 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 weeding, weeding, weeding. Oh, that's another clematis. I don't think it'll do very well because the tree has grown and it's got too much shade. Maybe I should move it. And here I let all, I sprinkled a million poppy seeds here. So it's going to be a whole pile of poppies and this is my very special Asian poppy. It should bloom soon. Um, that's about it here. Everything's happy. Happy, happy, happy. strawberry patch. We've been eating for about two weeks, three weeks, we've been eating the strawberries from the greenhouse over there. These are just starting to form strawberries. Two types. These ones are perennial strawberries and these bloom once. That's it. I got lots of food for the. I've got lots of food for the uh, butterflies. There. 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 I, I planted them everywhere. So when the monarchs decide to come and visit me, look at them all. Yay! Everywhere.
there, there. This is the vegetable garden. Potatoes, red and yellow, onions, onions, garlic, 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 onions, potatoes, raspberries, these are the red ones, they started making buds, the yellow ones haven't started yet, these are new tomato types that I'm trying, I have no idea what it's going to be like, they don't look thrilled, it's been too cold, and all different kinds of peppers here. There's five there with the white stickers come from my neighbor, like chocolate peppers. <laughs> I love it. And the asparagus are finished. There we go. Carrot seeded. English cucumber, which is doing nothing. Spinach, carrots. And lots of hostas that have to go somewhere. That's it. system works like a hot dam. This is where I got the big leaf because I can put it over there. Let's go for a little walk. This is the frog section. And I guess the water lilies are not even budding. It's too bloody cold. Different view here. 